Kelly Cato, baby. Oh! We got 80, man. Let's try to break bar, huh? <laughs> yes, Frank. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. All right, guys, this is it, baby. These are the days we put on the calendar months in advance and we count down the days until we get a chance to play. Today, we're playing at Sleepy Hollow Country Club, a top 100 golf course. This place is amazing. And we're gonna play a two-man scramble, me and Mike. We're gonna see the two of us working together here, strategizing, can break 80. We're also gonna take you through this amazingly epic golf course, show you some of the sights. Just wait until you see that 16th hole. Hang on to your hat for that one. Let's get off the first tee. All right, man, team scramble. Let's break 80, top 100 course, beautiful day. 400 yard hole, par four to kick it off. Oh yeah. That's a beauty. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Maybe just play this hole by yourself. You yeah. don't need me, man. I too, man. Yeah. Right. Nobody over there, right? Nope. Okay. All right, guys, I could definitely play my ball from here. This is actually the 18th fairway, but this hole opens up and you can definitely go right, which I like to get aggressive after that, off of that first tee for that reason. But Mike is in prime position. Prime. Let's go. Why are you firing it the other way? Because I wanted to see how long of a shot it was, man. That was 330. You hit this hill over here and it just ran, which tells me I think those greens are going to be really, really slick today. And what it also tells me is we're supposed to get some weather later on. The wind is going to be a factor today. But we're firing this pin here with the NX-10. What do you got? 81 to that flag. Let's go. Ah. Oh, over. Sit. Wow, the wind got us on this yeah. hole, didn't it? You almost had to play like 50 yards. Yeah, okay. She just flew. Sit. Nice shot. Way to pick me up there. Get that par, baby. Let's, Let's go. go. Come on. So this is our first roll of the day on these lightning quick greens. Frank's going to give us his first read for our par here. Let's go. Make a sandy. Oh. A little higher. I took too much off it. You could have drilled it home a little harder than that. I went weak, weak. Here we go. Let's go. Let's, Let's go. go. Par. All right. Par from the car. All right. All right. So this second hole, it goes up the hill what there is is a huge bunker on the right side there with this wind shouldn't be a big deal to carry it it's about 185 to carry it there's another bunker about 240 out on the left side which could come into play except it's going to play like more like 280. yeah it is man i just want to keep the streaks going let's go well i need to carry the bunker Yep. All right, so I'm right of the green here. I actually flew it over the right side bunker and I didn't realize how much this hole turns left. And this hole is, it's elevated and it's protected around it by bunkers. Got about a 75 yard shot. It's gonna play like 85 up the hill. It's gonna be a blind shot for us. We can't see the pin. That looks really good. Really good. Nice. All right, we got nice. one on. Yeah. Man, those blind shots, you sure hold your breath after. And you think, I hope it was good, felt good. Looks like it just carried the hill. Yeah. All right, let's go see what we got. By the way, look at those views of the Hudson behind you. Woo. Incredible, Can't incredible. Wait for it later on in the round. Yeah, for real. Probably in part two when you see the sun setting over there. Gonna, Gonna be, be sick. So we got two on here, nice shot. Now we just gotta pick the better uh, line. Okay. See. All right, strategy here. We're gonna take the further putt. We're gonna putt up the hill. These greens are lightning fast. This is gonna be an all pace putt. You leave it within three feet, get out of here with our par. All right, he understood the assignment. Yes, I like that. I like it so much. Good yeah. leave, man. Let's go tap it Let's in. Let's go tap that par in. All right, par, Let's par go. start. Let's go. We got 80, man. Let's try to break par, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. All right, guys, this is the third hole. It plays 160. Man, you miss right. She's gone. Bye-bye. And there is a bunker there that's probably deeper than the deepest pool you've ever swam in. So maybe uh, let's stay a little bit left here. What do you say? Hey, can you keep that commentary until after I swim? Hey, I'm just telling you where not to go, man. <laughs> Keeping you out of trouble. You're on my team today. Yeah. Looks yeah. nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Roll down to that hole. Well done. Eight iron. 
I really stayed laughing. Yep. This is what we call delicato. Nice delicate little touch here. Delicato, baby. Oh! Oh, I thought he had a bird. Top of that little hill there. Let that it trickle. hill's doing all the work. Just let it trickle. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot, Frank. Mm. Even Still that blows great by lags. The, Two great lag putts. Yep. Guys, par. Wow. Par train's feeling really train, good right man. now. I'll tell you the truth. It's feeling real <laughs> it good. It's real good. Only on the fourth hole. That weather's coming. The wind's coming in off the water. Give me the flag. Yeah. I tell you what, 16's gonna be no poke today. No, nope. you're right. There she is. We'll get there. 405 par four. Yeah, it's a poke, but it's straight out there. I see the flag. I remember this hole from when we played with Kevin. He was in that tree, he made that magic. We just wanna go over that mound there. It should trickle down a little bit. Hopefully like the first hole will only have like 100 in. Well, that, that should be real nice. Made that draw on purpose. So firm too, it's gonna run with that draw. Oh, I got real quick. Mike. You got quick, okay. Good thing you saved us on this one. Let's yeah, go. no worries. I gotta say I'm stoked about our performance so far through three holes and a drive because playing this Whistling Straits, the Straits course in a couple weeks, guys, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. You're gonna wanna see that because I think we're gonna two-man scramble that. Bet, we're gonna try to break par there or something. So, I don't know, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good right now. All right, let's scoop up my ball and go to yours. Do the old scoop, you ready? Do the scoop. Nailed it. All right, 115 playing 111. Great poke here. Okay, just short of the green, but safe. Yep. Don't tail, baby. Don't tail. Oh, tail. I tailed on you. Had the distance, but tailed left. So I've hired my own divot replacer. This is Dan. Dan the divot replacer. See if he knows what he's doing. The dirt side goes on the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> nice, step on it a little, put it in there, a little love. There it is, thank you, thank you. It's a little ribeye. My own divot guy. All right, these fairways are so nice and tight, we're definitely gonna get a channel favorite Texas wedge situation here. No doubt. This is just like an extension of the green, almost. Smart play, keeping it right of the flag. Yeah, we can make that. Yeah. You're probably gonna be better shape there. Okay, let's go check it out. Tina yeah, Green, man. This is your hole. We'll let you pot it. This huh? is your par, man. Let's go. Let me see if I can take it. Away. Yeah, well played. Nope. Oh. Yeah, you see? Because I, I was yeah. afraid of that. Yep. Never doubt. Nice job. Let's go. Even through right. four. Hey, I'm Even happy to have participated in this hole. No, I'm happy too. All right, now we are gonna go back into the wind here towards the water. And in fact, this par four is called panorama because as of right now you can't see much just that mound of the fairway it's all blind after that but as soon as you crest that hill you see why this hole is called panorama 386 yard par four here into the wind ah, too much hook. yep just got a little quicker yep All right, a little right, but we'll be on a fairway. We'll be okay. We're on the fourth fairway, but hey, we got a great look. I don't mind being a little right here. Yeah, you bombed. Bombed. 81 left, so. 81 left. Plays like 92 with the slope. A little thin, left. right? I might have went off the back. One hopped off the back. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. I think that's going to be good. Let's get, that, let's get that thumbs up from Zach. Yep, there it is. That's the validation. I know we depend on those. Like, we need them instantly. Let's go, Zach. Give us a thumbs up. We can't see the green. Right, right. This guy likes to leave us hanging. He knows he, we like to sweat. Let's yeah, just sweat, sweat it out. Yeah. All right, remember when I said this is called panorama? Well, you saw it over that first hill, but I'm about to show you over this back of the green. Look at this view. You can see the Hudson almost completely panoramic from left to right here. Incredible. Is that your ride? That's it. Chopper right there. He's doing circles, man. Someone must have called the authorities on us. He's looking for you. Because our game is too These hot guys, right They're playing too well. They're playing too well. Something's wrong. <laughs> Something's wrong, but I listen. I love the even par. I love we're doing great, but I want to make a birdie here. I want to go one under. I read this putt a thousand ways. I'm going to show you. This is my mark right here. See this little little burn area? That's what we're aiming at. All right, little up the hill on the way up. Let's do it. Go. Show me the way. There's a little outside my mark. See how 
Oh, that yeah. Was so close. I was a little outside of it. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, it's so close. We got each side of the hall. Each side. All right, another good par, though. Another right. good par. First par five here. Now we're heading away from the river here. Two tiered fairway moves to the right, well to the right. So it is possible with driver to push it through the first fairway and into the rough, get in a little bit of trouble. I don't think the second fairway is reachable. The top tier fairway, I'd have to fire it. I'm not sure what it is from this tee box. I'll tell you right here on Precision Pro. Maybe it is reachable. Yeah, I think it is uphill, but it's 240 to reach the guys. second one. Okay. okay, Precision Pro, let's go. Do you think we're playing somewhere epic? Look at the tee I just found on the ground. That's Jordan's The Grove. No, it isn't. Yep. Oh, it is. <laughs> Imagine whoever this guy is who played the Grove and comes up here and plays Sleepy. He's living a better life than me. Let's use that tee right now. I'm using it. Okay. Yes, Frank. Oh, that's ripped. Dude. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. This is going to be a get there in two right now. Oh, let's go. Oh. You want, would you like to use I'm going to use MJ's tee. Yeah, you might as yeah, well. It's, as well. Just, it's got some juice left in it. Well, one's in the fairway. Look at me talking myself out of reaching the second tier fairway, and here we are. Here we are with 211, two in uphill green. It's probably gonna play, we gotta fire up. It's probably gonna be about 220. 224 playing 231. So are you gonna go three wood here? I'm thinking about being the, the risky guy. No, yeah. I think I, I can definitely lay up something. Yeah. I can lay up a, a six iron. Do you wanna do that? No, I'm saying like, you hit first. You go first, okay. No, but I'm saying like like you it. might as well rip it. Yep. And if I don't, then we don't have to both lay up. This is no double layup channel. No, 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 we don't do that. Let's go. Maybe. Right. Here I'm here I am saying your ball will naturally move right. It just didn't. It always it does. It moves left. Okay. Okay. I like that a lot. Yeah. You're gonna be in great shape there. Okay. It's just a wedge out. Okay. What'd you guys do here? 211, par five, up a hill, a little wind. You laying up like Frank, you going for it like me. What's your strategy? Let us know. Now, now he's second guessing uh, himself. We're driving, we're placing a bet. The first video we ever did here was a playing lesson with Kevin Sprecker. And what I said was three years ago, I remember the spot, that tee box over there was where we took the, the cover image of the video. Epic shot down the hill. Mike thinks it's the 10th hole. You know what? As we edit this, we're gonna pop it up right here and see who was right. Yeah, let's think I dropped the envelope with the $100 bill in it. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, I told him, bring something in case we gotta tip the caddies. You lost it. Okay. Here he is. You think he found it? If I know you, it's in a bag or it's in a pocket. Why would you have it out? I had it in my pocket earlier. And... All right, let's Venmo the caddies if we ever run into them. You got 81 playing 86 up the hill. Oh, I thinned it again. I just got a couple holes ago. All right, it's on you. All right. Pick us up. Yeah, you did the opposite to me. Yeah. Try to take, go underneath as much as I could. Well, the nice thing about a par five is that you can get away with a little bit more of a mistake. Fortunately though, I don't know if we're gonna get our birdie, obviously. Let's just try to save our par here. That's a good one. That should be good. Get over that hill, roll towards the pin. Let's wait for that thumbs up from Zach. Nothing like a good bounce back shot, you yeah. know, after a bad shot, nothing like Definitely. it. Definitely. And that was our first real bad two shots, so. What? All right. Too much. Too much Wheaties on this hole. Yes. Oh, that God. Read, that was it. That was it. <gasps> Blew it by the break. I just thought, don't leave it short. Yeah. You know? All right. First bogey. All right, we got a par three here from these back blue tees. It's gonna play 207, playing 186 now on the hill. This kind of almost square-ish green. Very unique look from these tees, that's for sure. Ah. A little right. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, Oh that. yeah, go in the oh, hole. Do it. Let's go. Nice shot. Let's go. Let's get that bogey back. Yeah. Back Let's back. go. Did he get it? Oh, oh dude. Oh, <laughs> great putt though. That thing just looked over the cliff and didn't didn't want to commit. Let's go. The idea. Now let it roll. Just needs a little more. Thought we might get one back after that bogey there, but par is good on this long downhill par three. All right, this one's a poke. 485 into the wind. Par four. 
two holes left on this front nine. We are one over. Position A, if it stays out of that bunker. Yep. Good? A plus, A plus. Great. Just tailing a little bit. Okay, we're all right. 485, this is one beast of a par four. And it is one of the tighter fairways we've seen out here, protected on the left and right with fairway bunkers. Told you this one was a long haul. Still got 185 playing 190 left. We cleared the bunker, back of the green. About the way back portion of the green. Oh, she's gonna be a runner. She's gonna be a, a nice runner. Yeah, dude, look at it. Oh, I love it. I love it. Button, dude. Little stinger. Yeah, I didn't even plan that. <laughs> the unplanned stinger. Mike with the, the epic stinger. Look at him, he's even being nice enough to go pick up my ball. We got about a 15 footer for birdie. One of these birdies is gonna go down. You see it breaking right, sliding down the hill, right? Like a Mariano Rivera slider. Yeah, exactly. Slider fastball. Slider at the knees. I love that line. Ooh, great pace, nice look. Yeah. Still not high enough. You're right. All right, go knock one of those in. Nice. Okay, All right. another par. We are one over with one hole to go on this front. Back on the par train. All right, here we go. Welcome back to the tee box. Par four, ninth hole. And this, of course, is where I remind you guys, if you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on the bell notifications. We do a lot of flash giveaways on the channel. And you'll be able to make sure you don't miss the conclusion where we're gonna play the back nine here at Sleepy Hollow, including the epic 16th hole thumbprint. You're not gonna wanna miss it. Make sure you subscribe. All right, Mike, take us out there. Yeah, I'm going left today. I'm telling you, fire the hips. A little left, not the end of the world. It's okay. Left side by that tree. All right, 156, we got wind, we have rough. This is a tough one. Normally be an eight iron shot for me, but with the rough and the wind, on one more. Do that silky smooth seven. Right, mm. Middle of the green, safe, great, nice safe play. Ooh, we might be closer. Run. Get up, get up, get up, stop. Ah, stop. Okay, we got we got two. We got to pick a, a line. By the way, let me just say something. You're definitely gonna want to catch the next video where we take on the back nine because this is number ten. Look at this thing. That's that's what you put on the cover of a magazine right there. That's the one. What a hole. I lost. You lost, right? I lost the bet. See? Yeah. I told you that was the cover image. I thought it was this one. Well, well maybe we make this one this your one. Memory. <laughs> yeah. All right, we're gonna take yours, Frank, because Frank, you were on the top ledge. I was a little bit closer, but I was at the bottom of that hill. Yeah, this is a two-tiered green. It's just better to be up here. Definitely. One more leg. Didn't break like Man, I thought it would. I'm gonna mark that. Okay. Just straight. Yeah, it just doesn't break. Yeah, straight. The pace is great. Yeah. All right, so it's a wrap for the first nine. We are one over par. We're heading into the back nine here at Sleepy. This hole, I cannot wait for this, guys. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see this. And I don't know, Frank, 80? Yeah, maybe we could change that goal. We break a par today? Let's we'll go see. for par, baby. Let's go. Let's go.